I'm not gone. Oh my gosh! Holy mackerel, that was crazy! So as soon as I bit down, it was just like a burst of flavors all in my mouth and one shot is like mint and sweet and spicy and that was unbelievable, oh my gosh. This restaurant has been in operation for five years, but the business has been total for 25 years. Now we got to check out the reviews and these reviews were really good. And of course we checked out the menu and there were some things on there that we have not tried before. So we are so excited. This restaurant is called Saffron Indian Kitchen and I cannot wait to get in there. But first, don't forget to like this video, subscribe, ring the bell so we can continue making videos for you guys. And on that note, let's get in there. So guys, we just sat down at Saffron at the Grove and it smells glorious in here. It has like some spice and the aroma is just insanely delicious smelling. And as you can see, there is really nice paintings on the wall. So it just feels like so inviting, like you're transported into India. And I am so excited to tell you guys what we got. So we got what they recommend at this restaurant, which is the garlic shrimp, which is fresh prawns marinated with herbs and sauteed in garlic and cooked in tomatoes and coconut. Cannot wait. And then we got something that I'm so excited about. It is an Indian street food classic. It is called Pani Puri. So I have been wanting to try this. I've seen so many videos about it. It looks so interesting. So what it is is crispy fried puri filled with potato and thin served with pani. So I asked the waiter, uh, how do I eat this dish? And he said that there's several chutneys that go on it and then you fill it up. So can't wait to show you guys. And then we got, let me go all the way down. Now we got this really good lamb dish. Um, this is a chef's special. I'm not sure if I'm gonna pronounce this right. Nilgiri lamb korma. So this is a green lamb curry from the southern region of India and it has some sort of a green curry uh, gravy on it. I'm so excited about it and the uh, waiter was saying that this dish is really really good. It pairs with a side of rice. We got raita because I love raita. I love mixing that together and then we got the cashmere naan which is a naan stuff with mixed nuts and raisins. So delicious. Can't wait to show you guys. So here we have our first appetizer, the garlic shrimps. They look so delicious, so marinated. I am so hungry, guys. You can see that there's onions, there's green peppers. Um, there's topped with sesame seeds, too. All right, guys, let's not waste any time. I am so hungry. Let's get a little bit more of this gravy on here. 
Oh, look at the size of that. That is so perfect. Here we go. Mm. Oh my gosh. Those are so juicy. <laughs> they cook those to perfection. They're not gummy. They're not dry. Oh my gosh, this this curry here, I just want to take my spoon and just eat it. <laughs> it is so good. Can I get more of this? You taste the garlic. You taste, oh, so much deliciousness. I got an onion on here. Mm. That is lick your fingers good. So much flavor. The marination here is delicious. It is perfect. It has a little bit of heat, not too much. This is a great dish. Guys, really, really nice garlic, shrimps. Mm. Again, guys, lick your fingers. Delicious. <laughs> okay, guys, this next dish I am so excited about. This is a legendary street food dish. Take a look, the Pani Puri. I have seen so many videos on this and um, again, I have not tried it. So like, I have no idea how they make this little circle with the hole. I don't even know what that's made out of. Um, you guys can let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys for leaving me comments. Um, and yes, we do plan to visit India. We are so excited. We were planning to visit next year sometime early. We're just not sure about our itinerary. You can let me know in the comments though where we should go. But we are really excited. I want to try those authentic Indian flavors. Um, so yeah, I'm not sure how they make this. Um, and then inside there's some potato. And then a little bit of crispiness. Again, I'm not sure. You guys can let me know. And what is so cool about this is the waiter was telling me how I have to put these three chutneys on top. Well, I believe these two chutneys. And then this is, um, he said, is a has masala spices in it. He just said you add that at the end. So let's do it. We're going to add the mint chutney inside, he said. Then the tamarind chutney Ooh, that's gonna be a bomb of flavor and then this masala kind of liquid till the top okay guys wow it's actually like holding all of the juice <laughs> and then you eat it in one shot so let's try oh my god Oh my gosh! Holy mackerel, that was crazy! So as soon as I bit down, it was just like a burst of flavors all in my mouth and one shot is like mint and sweet and spicy and that was unbelievable, oh my gosh! That's crazy, I'm honestly like, I was just not expecting that. <laughs> I'm a little bit shocked. That is so delicious, like, I mean, of course, like, this is the most amazing street food. Like, this is so delicious. Wow, I'm really shocked. Okay, let's do it again. So the mint chutney is so refreshing. Then you got the tamarind that's like sweet. And then you got this masala liquid. I'm not sure what to call it. Maybe it is a chutney. You guys can let me know. And then when you just like go bite down, it's just like a burst of flavor. Mm. Mm. Oh my gosh. Okay. My taste buds are saying, my taste buds are saying, thank you. That is amazing. <laughs> that is so delicious. Like, it is the perfect snack. Like, honestly, you have crunchy, you have flavor, you have potato. Like, you have all the textures. Like, my mouth is just like, it, again, it's saying, thank you. <laughs> this is so good. I can't wait for Alfonso to try it. <laughs> 
also, guys, the manager came over and was asking us how we were enjoying the dishes. And oh my goodness, the pani puri is seriously just blowing my mind. And he gave me a little bit more information about it. So this is the pani and this is the puri. So I had no idea that, uh, you know, those two things meant what they are. So really, really cool. And I get to enjoy it again in front of you guys. So really really cool and i wonder how they get that perfect like circle there mint chutney this is so so delicious guys this is like my new favorite snack of all time <laughs> it is like the perfect like crunchy sweet minty it's really really good mm, mm, mm. This is an explosion of flavor and I'm doing it like this because it just goes across your whole palate and you just taste all of these beautiful flavors, the mint, the sweet. This beautiful dish is so, so good. Honestly, guys, this dish makes me want to explore more Indian street food. Like what other dishes can we try? This is already so delicious. Like. I just can't wait to try more of it. Let me know in the comments below what other Indian street food I should try because this dish has me wanting to explore more. So here we have the main dish of the evening, the lamb nilgiri. Now this is a southern Indian dish. Look how beautiful it looks. You got big pieces of lamb in a beautiful green gravy. We have the basmati rice on the side. Love basmati rice, so fluffy. And then over here we have the Kashmir naan. Look how delicious and fluffy this naan looks and take a look at the inside. Wow, that looks so beautifully coated. Wow, nuts, raisins, can't wait to get into it. So I wanna dive into this beautiful dish here. Look at the color, that looks amazing. I love curry, so creamy things for me, I, I just love it. Get a couple good pieces of lamb. We're gonna have basmati rice on the side here. Looks so fluffy and fresh. Okay guys, again, I have not tried this dish before. So excited. Okay, let's see if we can get a little bit of everything here. Ooh, it's really hot. <laughs> That is so soft. Oh my gosh. I just want to sit here and enjoy this moment. That is so soft. The thing that I love about Indian food is that the lamb and like the meats are so juicy and so soft. Like you cannot go wrong. And then of course, oh, my mouth is just drooling just because <laughs> there's so much flavor. <laughs> there's just so much flavor in this curry. It is unbelievable. Mmm, mmm, it has like some hints of sweetness. We got the mild one so little Alfonso can have some. It is so delicious. Wow. And then you taste like some sort of, um, I feel like it's cumin. You taste some sort of like deep spice and it's delicious guys. Wow, the lamb on its own is just like fall apart. Fall apart in your mouth. Oh my God. I wanna cry, that is so good. <laughs> that is so soft. I, and I just wanna keep, I just wanna keep diving into the curry too. Because this is amazing. Oh my God. Wow. Wow. I can't stop. I can't stop. It's that good. Oh my gosh. Wow. I'm super impressed. I wasn't sure what to expect with this dish, but it is seriously unbelievable. 
I want to get more of that mixture. You just can't go wrong with Indian food. It is just so flavorful and like so much history. And it's so delicious. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, guys. Something that I love doing, my favorite thing, is taking the naan and just going at it. So let's get another piece of this lamb. <clears throat> Extra curry because even though I have a lot of curry on my plate, I want more. <laughs> okay, guys. And then we're going to make a beautiful love blanket here. See if we can... Like, this is seriously my favorite. I, can't, I swear, I say that every video. <laughs> but it is my favorite. Mm. Mm. There is nothing better and warm and gooier than this combination right here. Like, if you need to feel happy or satisfied, just go to an Indian restaurant and you're just gonna feel like so much better. <laughs> you just feel comfort, satisfied, and it just puts a smile on your face because the flavors are so, so, so good. The naan is very, very soft and like um, gooey and not dry. It's like everything you would want in a naan. Oh my God. Every time I eat this, lamb curry from the southern part of india wow it puts a smile on my face like my mouth is still just watering and my mouth continues to want more so have a little more <laughs> even just the rice with the curry is like it makes me laugh because it's so good mm. wow I would literally lick the plate off. It is that good, guys. Oh, I'm so impressed right now. And you know what else I forgot? We got some raita. Check it out. I love the raita too. It's like a cooling um, like part of the dish. So I'm gonna put a little bit here. It looks like there's carrot and onion inside. And um, one more piece of I'm gonna I'm just gonna devour this whole lamb in front of everybody <laughs> so actually you guys can let me know in the comments below if raita goes with everything like I think the mixture of it all this is how I think it would flow mm. Mm. when you add the raita it's like another another dimension of flavor a cooling agent it is so delicious pairs so well with this food guys everything here has been so amazing so delicious and we are just gonna sit here and enjoy this amazing meal Ooh, wow that looks nice thank you how do you pronounce that again gajar halwa gaja gaja halwa <laughs> thank you yes yeah thank you okay guys so this was a dessert recommended and it is a carrot dish it's really hard for me to pronounce but this is a very traditional indian dessert made with carrots looks really really delicious i like how they served it too okay let's dive in oh wow that looks so good shredded carrots Ooh. Ooh, that is so sweet and warm and delicious. Like after having all of that savory food, then when you have this, it's it just opens my eyes more. <laughs> it is really, really delicious. And really sweet. And like warm flavored. Maybe there's some cumin in it, maybe there's some cinnamon in it. It just has something warm about it that is so delicious. It's actually really, really comforting, guys. Oh, there's a seed in here. Let me know what that seed is. Mmm. <laughs> that was good. I just ate the seed and I'm not sure if I'm supposed to eat it. 
but it has some sort of that warm flavor that I was telling you guys about that I was tasting in this dish. Maybe that was it. <laughs> really, really delicious. Warm, can you see the steam? Mmm. <laughs> mmm. What a delicious way to eat your carrots, honestly. <laughs> eat it in the dessert. It is really, really delicious, guys. What an amazing restaurant here at The Grove. It's in a great location. I love the whole environment and all the staff here have been so friendly, trying to tell me how I should eat it, tell me how to pronounce it. So you guys have to check this place out. We're gonna sit here, we're gonna enjoy this amazing dessert. Wow, guys, amazing food here at Saffron. Oh my gosh, everything was so delicious. The Indian street food has me so, so excited. And then the lamb dish was like heaven. Anyway, guys, you gotta check this place out. Like this video, subscribe so we can continue making content for you guys. And on that note, just keep on dancing. <laughs>